today I've been investigating um, gold spray paint for the egg that I'll be doing um, for Anik Gardens. So this is kind of an idea of what I'll be doing. Um, actually there's another picture somewhere, there's actually like a body will be falling out of the egg and the other one will be up in a tree. So I've been kind of checking out what paint to get because obviously you don't want rubbish paint, you maybe don't want to spend too much money either. Um, so as I look through quite a few different paints, this very metallic shiny paint um, came up and um, I located that one which was um, this Rust Oleum metallic paint. Um, varying in prices from about sort of seven fifty, so it's not you know it's not cheap. But I'm going to need loads of tins of paint. Um, there's lots of stuff online about the different paints, um, but not really knowing which one to get because it's like you can buy really cheap paint as well. So I messaged this graffiti artist called Frank Styles, sort of kind of known through. I don't really know him, but it just like through Facebook, and I thought I'd ask him. Um, I mean, he's got some amazing light stuff that he does. I thought being somebody who uses spray paints, he'd be an ideal person to ask. So I've messaged Frank about that. Um, and he was able to give me some really good advice, which I will have on here. Um, there's a few things that um, he said, and that was, how do I get the messages to go up? So, I sort of sent the pictures through of the items that actually that one's got the um, the body coming out. And he was sort of suggested um, some types of paint to use. He was also saying that I would probably need to use a resin over the top. <coughs> but before I put the resin on, he suggested that I put some sort of varnish to stop the, um, the actual spray paint from coming off. So obviously he's going to have a lot of um doing all these sort of murals he's going to have a lot of experience with what will actually last and what doesn't that's one of his pieces so he also directed me to this shop in newcastle that sort of specializes in paint for graffiti artists <coughs> excuse me for the cough um so i need to get in touch with them they're in newcastle and I could, you know, it's probably good to get some really good advice about what is actually going to work and what isn't. So that's me on the hunt for paint. <laughs> 